Hello guys, we're doing a bathroom remodeling and in this video I'm gonna show you how to repair drywall around bathtub and um, I'm also gonna show you how to prepare drywall for knockdown texture. I'm starting with measuring and uh, cutting drywall that I need. As you can see, it is very easy you don't need help here and uh, I was able to cut even big pieces without any help. To cut drywall I'm using utility knife and if blade isn't sharp enough you can always replace it. And when you cut a piece of drywall that you need, secure it with drywall screws. I want to show you drywall screws I'm using to attach drywall to wood studs. And I need to cut a small hole for shower arm. So I installed drywall on the top and now I'm gonna be working on this side of the bathtub. And if you can, you can just cut one piece for this side, it's gonna be much easier for you when you will be finishing drywall, but because I had a lot of extra pieces, this is why I'm using them right now. Now I'm gonna be installing plastic corner with drywall screws. And for the joints I'm using self-adhesive tape. It is very easy to work with it, you just stick it to the wall and cut it where you need it. When I applied joint tape to corners and joints, it is time to start applying drywall compound. For this job I am using premixed joint compound that you can find in Lowe's or Home Depot. When you apply drywall compound, wait for about 24 hours until it dries. After 24 hours I can start sanding walls with sanding block. Try to make your surface as smooth as possible for the second coat of drywall compound. When you finish sanding, you can wipe out all of the dust with wet cloth. It is time to apply the second coat of drywall compound. It is not a rocket science, just try to make the surface as smooth as possible. So I finished with applying the second coat of drywall compound and uh, probably it will be the last coat because I'm planning on applying knockdown texture. So 
the knockdown texture will hide all of the imperfections and if you want to know how to apply knockdown texture watch my next video if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you don't want to miss my next video hit the bell notification button thank you for watching and i'll see you next time